Governor Fitzhauer is going to be part of our next panel. I believe we also have with him uh, uh, Mark Kelly and I believe uh, Chief Henderson. Chair Rosanski, I must protest to this testimony from Mark Kelly. Mark Kelly is not a resident of the state of Oregon. Sir, Mark Kelly is not a resident of the state of Oregon. Why is he relevant to this issue? Sir, do you need to sit down? We want to say part of our process, not a trend here to start, but as we said, we're not trying to have to sell it. Evaluated and deemed mentally ill. And then if Arizona would have shared that information with the National Instant Criminal Background Check system, possibly he would not have passed a background check. Now here's part of the problem. So he went to a sporting goods store where he passed a background check. Let's just say, um, he had been adjudicated mentally ill, and that system was shared with the federal government. He would have failed background check in the sporting goods store. But what would he have done then? In Arizona, unlike Oregon, in Arizona he'd go to a gun show, like, and that would, that would likely happen. If this same scenario happened here in Oregon, I suppose uh, a similar person would go to the internet to get around uh, the background check loophole. Um, but in the case, you know, of Jared Lochner, yes, he helped pass the background check. Now, there was also uh, evidence that the U.S. Army had, strong evidence. He self-admitted that he was 